Right, here we go. That's it. Uh, we have washed our tractor. We are just taking uh, this harvester back to the garage uh, and uh, probably we should repair it before we do so, but uh, okay. This is gonna be really really awkward. Ooh, oh, I almost said, oh, we barely made it, we didn't, we hit it anyway. Yeah, so we're done for this year. Uh, we don't have much left to do. I was thinking of doing something uh, that can actually, yeah, uh, one thing I forgot. And disconnect. Okay, you can stay here. Yeah, there's uh, one thing I want to do. Let me see what we can do here. So, we have fields here that we own and that we don't own. Uh, it's weird when they are in all these different colors. I was thinking something maybe in the lines of field 24 or maybe field 10. Let's check it out. I'm just gonna jump to there and see the price 61,000. Right, and what about the 24? 91,000. Right, um, there's one trick I have uh, left up my sleeve, and uh, that is this one here. Um, silage. I can sell silage. Uh, it's around 250 per yeah we have quite few here we go like we said we finished in last moment this uh, 
episode, uh, this uh, harvest. There's no more harvest left to harvest and everything is indoors. Now, yeah, our fields look really nice. We have uh, already prepared some of them for the next season. For example, this one and this one can be planted already. Um, one of them would definitely be canola, maybe even now the def yeah. I need to plan where I'm gonna put the uh, straw producing um, crops because they we need uh, to feed our power plant there. So obviously six is gonna be wheat or barley, and then what else we have? Yeah, we need wheat and bar wheat and barley in those um, uh, fields where the root crops were, because I think after root crops you have to s uh, seed those. Maybe uh, canola. I'm not really sure. I need to check that. Yeah. But we definitely need to buy one more field. Okay, uh, for the rest of this episode, we gonna go and try to earn some money. We can do selling this loose silage, uh, which is not what we're gonna do. I'm gonna do it by selling uh, silage bales. We have 39 silage bales there, and we're gonna try to load them up on our trailer here. But I don't think that's going to be enough either, because I'm not going to be loading 30 bales in this trailer. Uh, we might go like 10, 15 or so. Can we get out of here? Yeah. Right, I'm just going to grab... Oh, I jumped uh, another tractor. Um, yeah, that's not good. I don't usually like doing that, but um, unfortunately, sorry guys. Yeah, I'm playing with the uh, keyboard now. I'm gonna finish up with that. Here we go. And we're gonna load up some bales and uh, we're gonna go and sell them. Right, so... Yeah, now I'm thinking now, sh how should I um, arrange the bales? Do I put them like this? Okay, they put them as they are now, or should I flip them on their side, where I can then uh, put more of them on? But I'm not really sure how much we're gonna put, how many bales we're gonna put on here. I don't know how much we can even fit on here, but uh, they're pretty convenient. They're in pretty convenient location there, so we shouldn't have any issues loading them. Hopefully, even pretty fast. I still wanna, even though it's the last episode, I still wanna. Um, keep it nice and short. Right. Okay, let's see how much we can load in a few minutes. Uh, there we go. Okay. Now, my question was, uh, what do you think, guys, is it better to load them up like this, like they are now, or should we put them on their side like this? I think, sh I think we should try loading them like this. Okay, it's in a place. Okay, let's hope that this can be painless as it was with the first bale. But let me tell you something, it never is. It never is. I know, I know, I'm being grumpy in the last episode and it should be joyful, joyful occasion. occasion. But let's check it out how we can deal with this. That's good, that's two down, and 
who knows how many more to go. Right. Okay, this is one of those quiet moments where Uliki is trying to concentrate of n on not uh, messing this up. And in the end, he messes up anyway. What the? Right. I don't see this working out. <laughs> uh, right. I think when you put bales in this position, you're done. Nothing can be done with them anymore. There's no saving them. Oh no. Oh no. Okay. Um, That's number three. Let's go for ten. Whatever happens, ten bales have to be on there as long as it takes. Okay, number four. I already see we're gonna have issues with that bale that's not cooperating. Should I just try to stack them like this, maybe? Okay, let's take them randomly a bit. Yeah, this is one of the chores we can actually do while it's raining because everything is closed off, everything is uh, should be perfectly dry and safe. And w w what's with this? What's with the magnetism here? Since when did I become Magneto? Look at this. Dude, lay off. Fine. Look. Magnets. Wow, okay, that was extremely awkward. Okay, like I said, time for Leaky to mess everything up. Right, four, five down. Right, yes, five down, five more to go. Six. I'm not sure if I'm gonna fit. Oh yeah, the sticky bale. Is it sticky bale or sticky bale handler? I'm not really sure which one this constitutes to be. Let's try it like this. If we push it a bit over, or just just leave it, just just leave it, just, leave it. just detach it, lift your arm up, and just go, go away. Leave it there. Leave it there. We just need to uh, need to put the opposite side as well, so I can um, put the straps on. Okay, let's see where this one is gonna go. Uh, 
Right, two more to go. This is not going too badly. Okay, this is number nine. Okay, this is not gonna work like this. And I have a feeling that this bell stuck to the other one. Right. So we were down from nine to seven bales. Okay, let's try this on one more time. Okay. fine one more to go and I'm using keyboard and mouse because I was thinking like yeah of course I'm gonna use it it's gonna be much faster like this I don't know now maybe I should have just used the side panel okay now let's do it the physics way physics says no this way I swear I really need to stop the uh, recording when I'm doing bales or something like this because this is this is pathetic I can't believe uh, I'm incapable of having a normal conversation when I'm concentrating. <laughs> oh, this is hilarious. Yeah, anyway, okay, let, let's let's deal with this one, last one, and let's uh, put this episode out of its misery. Okay, there we go. Number 10. We still have like 29 bales ready here to be uh, uh, transported back to the farm or sold off. Whatever we choose is the best. And uh, should we just try to drop it? Yes! Dropping part physics wins this time. We win physics. Okay. Um, this, turn off, turn off, and let's go. Let's see how we can get out of this field and let's go sell all these bills. I'm hoping for a 10,000 euro. But I'm also hoping for an easy episode, but no. You can actually see in a timestamp how long it took us to record this one. Like hours. I think like two hours or so. Almost. I mean, it's not still done the editing and uh, uploading and all that good stuff. This is going to be one of the longest episodes in creation since I started recording. But it's fine. It's it's it's, it's fine. I'm convincing myself to that of that. Yeah. So we're gonna go and uh, sell off the bales at Grain Elevator Village. Grain Elevator. I think that was the closest sell point. Yeah, appears so. We have somewhere another one, but not sure where. Oh, okay. This is a shortcut here. Next to our field 18 on the right side. Yeah, we're gonna have to uh, fertilize that field in the spring also. This is, I think, our uh, the most convenient field. Okay, let's check it out this way. 
It's convenient because it's long and squarey. I know I just invented that word. Uh, so I like it. But considering, you know what? I think I'm gonna buy. I know then field number ten is also the one we need. I think I'm gonna buy field thirteen. I think I just made a decision. Okay. I think this was a bit overkill on the arc here. Field thirteen is on our way back to the farm. Okay, sixty thousand seven six seven. Well. Well, <laughs> um, I'm gonna go on a limb here and say that those <laughs> bales didn't ferment. <laughs> oh wow, I just swelled grass bales. Well, fun. <laughs> that doesn't matter. Okay, it happens to the best of us. They're gonna be salvaged soon. And obviously the person who bought them uh, gonna earn a lot of money. Okay, we're gonna go to field 13, which looks like it's a bit smaller than the field... Sorry, the field 13 is next to field 11 there. It's kind of awkwardly shaped, but I like it. And I have to see what's there. This is... It's a forest, right? And a hill. I would really like to see what we can do with that field here. Let's see map one more time. It's here on the left. Okay, it's already seeded. I did not know that. I do apologize, but I do not care. And it's wheat or barley. Looks like wheat. Map says barley of course yes so let's see mm, 64,000 no we don't have enough okay that was shocking uh, never mind we're just gonna get this field here no no we're gonna we're gonna lay off uh, buying field for now uh, we're gonna buy it if we continue these episodes because this is a really good price for a field and this is field that I would like to buy and it's kind of even close to the farm because it has nice access to the farm from um, field number six road going directly there or between five and four we have the road going directly to the forest and just before the forest on the left we can access this field which is really convenient and no traffic there Okay, guys, that's it. Now that's it. Seriously. Thank you guys for watching. And until the next map, in some other worlds and some other places. Have a nice day, guys. And see you again soon tomorrow. Bye-bye.